Hey guys, Jeep right here. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to SnowRunner. Hope you're all doing well today. Today we are gonna bring our first oversized haul. So for today's mission, we get to pick up. We're going to pick up this construction rig here, and we're gonna drive it all the way over here to the drink, drilling site because we're making some kind of drill or something. Um, let's see the best route. This route looks a little shorter. Mm, lots of sad dirt roads. We got some paved roads. This right here looks a little bit sketchy, though. I do think we can. Oh, this one's like driving in the water. Oh, this one looks scary, but it looks shorter. And over here, we got this nice paved road, which I think is the safest way to go. Oh my God, we have something blocking. Oh, I remember this route. Yeah, I got stuck here a couple of times, so I'm kind of scared to go this route. That's why I have the trailer there, because I got stuck there quite a few times. I could go all the way around and then go over the bridge and then, yeah, I think I'm going to do that. All right, so let's plan our route. Um, we're taking a relative safe route, not a lot of mud to get stuck on. I'm trying to go, you know, take the paved roads as much as possible. Uh, let's see here. Yeah. And then go around. Oops. Take the bridge here. Then go take this dirt road. Should be safe. And then take this wooden bridge. And there is our objective. All right. So we got our route plan now this thing is making some kind of humming noise so hopefully it doesn't get annoying while i'm driving because otherwise it's gonna be a little bit annoying all right this thing looks massive by the way doesn't even look like it's gonna fit on this truck this is also the newest truck uh to my collection found it in one of the areas there we go lined up perfectly and then we get to attach it there we go nice and massive let's change the camera so what's this thing all about looks like some kind of heavy machinery generators motors i don't know bunch of stuff all right guys here we go oh i can't see jack Oh, that's going to be an issue. Yeah, so this is the first oversized haul. I I am, like, moving around. And the camera angle is kind of not the best. We're going to try to do a no damage and, you know, don't hit any uh, anything. No, no, yeah, I think I'm going to hit some poles. <laughs> not going to lie, I'm not the best driver. But we're going to try to do a no damage run. Unless it's like these rocks, these rocks kind of uh, damage your suspension, which is kind of annoying. Camera angles in this game aren't the best. Uh, yeah, I think I'm going to just do it like this for now. Oh, yeah, no, this is even worse. I, yeah, no. Yeah, I'm not that good yet. Just going to do it like this. There we go, nice and slow. All right, so far so good. So is there anyone uh, that watches this uh, type of content on my channel playing SnowRunner? If you are, let me know in the comment section down below. I already had one person reach out to me that he wants to help me with mission. Oh man, I gotta go down there. Yeah, I got one person reach out to me that he wants to help me with missions and stuff and you are more than welcome to my friend. Just uh, add me on Epic Game Store Ooh, or Discord. Oh, I'm rolling down the hill. Take it nice and slow. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, okay, so that is... I mean, I guess we can make it. It's kind of cheating. Oh, whoa, it can like... Maybe it can like flatten the tire. Let's not take any chances. Let's make it uh, a wider turn here. There we go. 
Wow, it really pushes you downhill fast. I'm just breaking constantly. All right, there we go. Okay. Make another white turn here. I think this is a lot more fun to play on a controller. I do have a 360 control. Uh oh, I do have a 360 controller that I can use. That way, it has pressure sensitive triggers, so you can, you know, slowly. Okay, I'm stuck. Okay, we need to back it up a little bit. Our turn needs to be wider. So I'm gonna try. Oh, that was a misclick there. Make a wider turn. Let's go in the low gear. Just so I don't have to tap, tap, tap all the time. There we go. Let's, let's go a little bit to the right. Okay, in real life, my mirror would have been busted already and stuff like that. There we go. There we go. Beautiful. All right. There we go. Let's pop it back into automatic. All right. Nice. I think we're like not even halfway yet. I don't think so. Not even a quarter of the way. Okay. Make a nice white turn again. Try not to hit any of the signs. Oh. Let's try not to hit that ball. I think I'm already hitting it somehow. Yeah, I think I was hitting it. Oh, oops. Alright, we're good now. Whoa, 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 oh, this thing can tip pretty easy, I see. Good thing I did the long route because I'm pretty sure we would have tipped over in that, like, uh, smaller road. All right, so, okay, we do have enough fuel. We got nothing damaged yet. Let's be careful. Oh, what the heck? Yeah, camera angles are the camera movement. Our reaction to certain areas is just super annoying in this game why does it feel like it's one it wants to tip over all right all right let's quickly check the map that kind of looks scary oh we're halfway done nice looked scary but we got this i hope we have enough power i do think we do Yeah, uh, struggling a little bit, but we have the power. Oh, maybe not. Come on, you can do it. There we go. There we go. It's actually kind of easy. This is the first um, like area of the game, like Michigan. So this might not be the uh, hardest oversized uh, cargo I need to transport. Oh, whoa, whoa, kind of wobbly wobbly there. Okay, I'm, I am going to hit these um, just because they're kind of in the way. And there's no really good way around them. Okay, let's see how we're going to do this. Oh, we got this. It's 
Okay, we, we are gonna hit that sign though. Oh. We're kind of stuck. So back it up a little bit. Stick to the right a little bit more here. There we go. There we go. Yeah, man, I imagine this thing in a real life moving something super huge or super, on something oversized it must be super difficult. Like because of this game, I started watching like these random videos on YouTube of, of uh, oversized tall and dangerous roads and stuff like that. It's kind of interesting. Like stuff like this does exist and does happen every day. Like I remember watching one of the uh, doc documentaries of uh, people that want to go to another town. It takes like a month and a half just to reach the other town, that which is like 60 or 300 uh, miles away or something or kilometers. I don't know, something crazy like that. Just because it's like nothing but mud and like rocks and bad roads and stuff like that. It's crazy, man. It's real crazy. Something that should take like maybe an hour or something. All right. This thing's pushing me downhill again. I have a feeling this video is going to be like super long again. <laughs> I have so far I have two uh, mud runner or snow runner videos up that are both like 30 minutes. I'm trying to make them. Oh, can we pass through this bridge? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, we just made it through. Just have enough clearance. Nice. All right. So, so far, zero deaths. No damage on the vehicle or the trailer, which is nice. I wonder if the trailer. I don't think trailers can get damage. Oh, it's just going to push me. Oh, there we go. Things might get a little tougher here. I, I think I'm going to have to hit this sign here at 15 kilometers per hour sign. I think it's going to be the first thing I'm going to destroy. Trees don't matter. I mean, trees matter, but. Nope, we didn't hit it. Oh, and the tree is still alive as well. Nice. There we go. Yeah, it's still up there. Oh, we're pretty close. I can see the uh, the destination. There we go. Um, it is kind of wobbly. Oh man, I really don't hope we flip. Because if we do, I'm gonna have to go to the garage and get a creamed vehicle. Oh man. Stop wobbling, man. This this vehicle can also carry a, tr uh, a crane in the back and a high saddles, but. I don't know, the crane's kind of ugly on the vehicle, so I didn't bring it along. But I don't think it would have enough power to... Uh oh, there we go. We're getting into some sticky situations here. Trying to not use our crane if we don't need to. I mean, our winch. But this thing is so heavy, I think we're going to have some issues here. We are running altering tires, I believe 51 inches, 51 inch wheels. There we go. We got through that. Okay. We don't have far to go. We need to go on that island or right, we need to reach that island. All right. I think, I think, I don't think this area is like really that hard to move maneuver through. I think I, I think we, we can even cross over here, but then we're, we're going to damage our. Uh oh, all right, let's make some white turns here. Oh, I think I remember this area. This area is pretty, uh, pretty sticky, pretty muddy, might have some issues, but let's hope not. There we go. Don't flip. All right, let's take the left. Oh. I have a feeling I'm going to hit that sign. Yes, I am. Hmm. Is it worth it to flip our vehicle because I don't want to hit a sign? I don't know, man. 
I'm gonna pretend I don't. I'm not gonna see it. There we go. We didn't even hit the sign. Yay, there we go. Nice. I am kind of stuck though. Signs are unharmed. I think after this, I can just go with this footage to a company like, hey, I want to be a truck driver. Look, I got the skills. This is my resume. I just showed them the footage. <laughs> uh, there we go. This is your easiest part. It's just this wooden bridge now. I bet this is the whole journey of me doing this took like 30 minutes, I think. Oh, this is extremely muddy and we have no, whoa, don't, 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 whoa, whoa, wait, wait, oh, this is sketchy. So our vehicle just sank a little bit into the mud without me even driving. Okay, I should have just kept moving because now we're stuck. It just pushed us into the ground. Oh, man. Shoot. Anything to win? Oh, we got something to winch on. Because I don't think we're going to get loose from this. This is pretty muddy. And we might even be able to drive in the water. Whoa. Let's just keep moving. Keep moving. Oh. Yeah. I don't think it's a little bit too late to go into low gear, maybe. Yeah. Ah, this is rough. Uh, I think we're going to have to go and grab another vehicle. God, I don't want to do that. <laughs> no, we're so close, dude. 136 meters. Wait, wait, wait. I got it. I got it. I got it. We can use... The winch. Oh. Uh, God damn. We're winching ourselves forward using the trailer. Oh my God, that's such a clever idea. Uh, there we go. Yeah, I like using that trick. I'm not sure if. A lot of people do that, but it's really helpful to winch yourself forward when you're stuck. God dang it. I'm so happy I didn't have to grab a vehicle and get ourselves out of that situation. Uh, <laughs> All right. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Come on, you can do it. Then our on headlights. Wow, it took us all day to get here from morning till dusk, I believe this is called. There we go. Now, um, this mission, you're collecting certain parts and bringing them here to build like a oil refinery or something. But unfortunately, I was collecting trailers here and one of my trailers got stuck over there. So as you guys can see, we got two trailers there, but one is like in the assembly of the refinery. Can't get it out. If you guys have any ideas how to get that out, let me know. All right, here we go. We made it, guys. Mission complete. Come on, just a few more meters. There we go. There we go. Nice. Got a lot of XP and some cash as well. Well, guys, there you have it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video of me hauling a very big assembly rig, rigger magic. Uh, let's just mess around with this trailer to maybe I can get it out or something. Does this really stuck in there? Kind of messes with the scenery, I think. Yeah, so as you guys can see, it's like it's really stuck. And if I hit it, it just damages my vehicle. Yep, can't get it out. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm just going to mess around with this thing a little bit. See if we can move it. 
Next time we have unlocked our new scout vehicle, the six wheeled monster. We're gonna mess around with that in the new area and get one of our new vehicles, the Ford F750 or the Taz, I believe it's called. The DUZ D -U -Z -R -T -A -Z, one of those. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next one. Hope you guys have a great day. Peace out.